Thanks for joining us tonight for the News at 10. The city of Eagle might get a lot bigger. It depends on whether the city decides to annex Appamore, a very large planned community up in the foothills. You see it along Highway 55 and expand city limits by doing so. Tonight, for the first time, people who live in Eagle went before the Planning and Zoning Commission to share their thoughts on that annexing plan, the development that goes along with it. And while some are in favor of that expansion, there's a lot more that are against it. Abby Davis has been at the meeting since 6 o'clock this evening. And it just, oh, I guess it continues right now as we speak, right? Yeah, it does continue. Public testimony still going on, Abby? It actually just ended. They swore that they would end the meeting at 10 p.m. regardless of how many people actually got to testify. And let me just say it was packed inside City Hall tonight. You can see people are starting to trickle out of the building now, but I counted the sign in sheet. There were more than 130 people here. So many people that some were even directed to an overflow room. Avamore's lawyers and city staff spent three and a half hours going over the application and addressing planning and zoning commissioners concerns. Right now, as you drive north on Highway 55, you'll see about 800 homes as well as mixed used buildings. When Avamore is fully built out around 2060, so not for a long time, there will be about 10,000 homes. If annexed, about 9,000 of those Avamore homes and 860,000 square feet of commercial space would be an eagle. 50% of the land will be protected natural open space, so it's not like all of that land will be homes. An analysis shows if annexed into Eagle, Avamore would bring upwards of 21,000 new people into the town over the next 30 years. That's a 64% increase in population, and some people worry that growth will strain services, resources, and Eagle taxpayers. There's not enough information, not enough technical analysis on some of this stuff. Um, really, why isn't it its own city? Um, why aren't we putting this to a vote of the citizens? We are the ones who are going to be impacted. This should come to us, not relying on four city council members and possibly a mayor's vote, and they were supported by the developer. It just doesn't sit right with the citizens of Evil. One planning and zoning commissioner asked Avamore's lawyer if they ever considered creating their own city. Avamore's lawyer said they've considered all options, but think it's in their best interest to become a part of Eagle. And while they didn't do so tonight, since the meeting went so long, once again, they only had 30 minutes for public testimony. Planning and zoning will eventually make a recommendation about whether the city should annex Avamore. However, regardless of their recommendation, the application will go before city council. So city council will have that final say there is no timeline for that. But like I said, only 30 minutes for public testimony. So that will continue going into the next planning and zoning meeting. Just lots of people here that want to share their opinions either for or against this annexation. OK, we'll keep everyone posted when that next meeting is scheduled. Important to note in that soundbite you heard from the woman who testified, she said that there were 70 letters submitted in opposition of this annexation and just about three, I believe she said in favor mm. of annexing Avamore. And I did a story on this last year. You guys can go check it out on our website, ktvb.com, that talks about annexation, why so many people are against it. And, and I also spoke with the mayor of Eagle who went on to say, you know, this he believes could be beneficial for the city of Eagle. So there's people on all sides of the spectrum. Well, you here. know the background on this, but wasn't that community planned to be an independent community set aside from everything else, mm -hmm. right? Up in the foothills. Yep. Yeah, so it will be interesting to see how this plays out. All right.